is TK here, TK with the risk card, here to give you my review of Yu-Gi-Oh! The Dark Side of Dimensions. Um, it has to say, that boy Kaiba, Seto Kaiba, he got some technology that's just, that junk, that junk got way out there. I think that technology that I seen in this movie is way advanced than this stuff and all the new Yu-Gi-Oh! Um, series they got going on. Like, the last, the last newest one I saw was Ark. So yeah, so it's like Kyrie he just, that boy is too rich. <laughs> but um, yeah, Yu-Gi-Oh! The Dark Side of the Dimensions, I believe it's called. Um, yeah, great movie in my opinion, really enjoyed it. This movie, like, it's only like about two hours long, but it felt like it was longer than that, which is good, you know. Well, y'all, I'm not really gonna talk too much about it, because I don't wanna spoil, like, the story stuff. But if you're an OG Yu-Gi-Oh fan, you know y'all know how they do on on this on Yu-Gi-Oh. You know with the vowels and stuff, you know. Um. So basically, the 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 um base the villain of this of this of this um movie, his name is well his real name is Diva, but he's he was going by Agami, and uh, he pretty much. Wants revenge, and he wants to prevent the Pharaoh from being reborn, which is what Kaiba is trying to do. Cause Kaiba, he wants to battle the Pharaoh, and he's been like, he's been having this um dual simulation thing going on, when I'm practicing battling him and stuff. So yeah, he's he's really determined to get a rematch with the Pharaoh and try to beat him. You know, um. The story was very good in my opinion. Um, we had we had four or five duels, I believe. Uh, two of the duels actually didn't like was like a total like end to it, you know. Uh, but two great. I mean, we had a couple of we had about let's say about four or five duels, but all the duels looked it really good. Um, a lot of new monsters. Um. This is what I'm gonna talk about. Like we got uh, a Neo Blue Eyes White Dragon. We got this Chaos Blue Eyes White Dragon. We got some other dragon. He got Yugi surprises with a dragon towards the end of the movie with a dragon. Um, dark Magician looked it pretty dark. Like he was, he didn't look like the regular like, Dark Magician. He looked it like a dark evil <laughs> magician. Um, we saw some new magicians as well, like, you know, Dark Magician Girl, we got this other magician, it's like, I believe, like, it's like a lemon magician girl, I think, and we got, like, an apple magician girl, um, yeah, the monsters looked it very nice, they had different looks to it, we had a surprise monster, um, return, played by Kyber, uh, I'm not gonna say it, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna let y'all, Watch it and experience it for yourself and get get that surprise. You know, I, I kind of knew what it was when it happened because I'm I'm just a big fan of Yu-Gi-Oh, so I pretty much knew what Kaiba was about to pull out to clutch it. But um, yeah, um, so yeah, it, the, like I said, the main character he's pretty much trying to basically get revenge and pretty much prevent the throw from being um. Reborn and like I said, Kaiba is trying to get um the feral. He trying he he basically was trying to collect the pieces for them for the the puzzle you know that you used to wearing used to wear all the time and um of course make Yuki wear it and become the feral and do them you know but that was that was pretty much the main purpose of um that without trying to, without trying to spoil any other things that happened in the movie. But that was like the two main focuses of this movie right here. Um, if I was to rate it, I'd give it an eight. You know, very good movie, nice and entertaining. You know, I enjoyed it very much. Um, yeah, great movie in my opinion. But yeah, if you have seen this movie, leave a thought in the comments down below. You can follow me on Twitter, Instagram, and any other social media just by clicking my name and going to my YouTube banner. On the bottom right, I got all my links, so just click on that. Also, I got my anime list account, so you can click on my, well, 
profile. I got a link in the description. Click my link. Go check out my profile. You see all my favorite anime, favorite characters, anime I'm watching, anime I plan to watch, anime I already watch, all that stuff. So check it out. Also, if you haven't already, go check out my two recent videos. I did a channel update and I did a you. I mean, I did a um, Dragon Ball Super episode review. And I think I did another video. Yeah, I did anime I recommend video as well. So go check those videos out. Um, yeah. Sword Art Online ordeal still will probably be the next movie review for the anime I will be doing. So stay tuned for that. Until next time, I'll talk to you later.